All right, let's go to Teresa now. She is live. It appears that you were able to get a little closer to Union Square. If not, are you are you in that area now, Teresa? We're about a block away, Natasha and Antoine, just right down this, right down that road is Union Square. It's incredibly busy over here right now. Uh, for those who are very familiar with Union Square, this area is always busy. But there is sort of a renewed uh, presence, if you will. There are people who are lingering to see what's going to happen, to see if they have seen the end of this or not. Lots of kids coming around, waiting to see what the cops are going to do, waiting to see, uh, again, if this thing is essentially over. Uh, interestingly enough, a lot of them that are talking to us are also wondering if Kai Sinat is still in the area. We told them that he is not, that he left, that he was, you know, escorted out of here. And, and Chief Madry echoed that. He said that he has essentially been safely taken away, not arrested as many outlets are reporting or perhaps as we are seeing all over social media. There does not seem to be confirmation of that. It appears as if for his safety, he was removed from this area. That is important to note based on the pictures that we have seen and the eyewitness accounts of what happened here today. Uh, much of what we heard live on our air was echoed by the NYPD. People throwing things, breaking into a construction area, uh, throwing paint cans, throwing chairs, throwing bottles, even if it's a water bottle. If you're not expecting that and you're hit in the back of the head with a water bottle, uh, it certainly can make you very fearful. We heard from a mom and her son who said she hid behind a tree because she was afraid that her and her son were going to, excuse me, that her and her son were going to be hurt in this mayhem. We've heard of people holding on to the back of cars. Uh, as Kai Sinat was attempting to go away. He is incredibly popular. If you are not somebody who is familiar with Twitch or maybe even YouTube and certainly not Kai Sinat, he is one of the most followed, one of the biggest celebrities on these platforms. And so, it, and he's also a hometown guy. He's from New York. So he's the kind of guy that's going to be able to bring out tens of thousands of people. He's done these giveaways before. They haven't ended like this. Today was something different. And if you listen to what the NYPD was saying, they're going to get to the bottom of why today ended differently than a lot of these other giveaways that we have seen in New York City. Uh, Antoine and Natasha, I know that you know we are no stranger to large crowds. We are no strangers to demonstrations. And by and large, they really are peaceful. Uh, today turned violent and people were injured. Not the injuries that a lot of people were expecting based on the video that they were seeing or the eyewitness accounts that were coming out. But still, it wasn't supposed to end like this. They were, they were giving away gaming consoles. And this is what happened. We'll send things back to you guys in the studio. All right, Teresa, stay safe out there. Also, we'll check in with you in just a little bit.